respiration. We know that respiration is the process in which living organisms use oxygen to break down food molecules, glucose, to release energy. Let us learn more about respiration in plants. Before we go any further, do you know why respiration is important? Respiration produces energy which is required by plant cells to perform various functions. Respiration in plants occurs in the following steps. Oxygen from the atmosphere enters the leaves through the stomata present on the underside of leaves. From here, they move to the leaf cells that contain glucose. A chemical reaction occurs in which oxygen breaks down glucose into carbon dioxide and water, releasing energy. The energy is used up by the plant for performing various functions. Carbon dioxide and water molecules are released back into the air through the stomata. In woody stems, respiration takes place through lenticels. Respiration is of two types, aerobic and anaerobic respiration. Respiration that occurs in the presence of oxygen is called aerobic respiration. Respiration that occurs in the absence of oxygen is called anaerobic respiration. During aerobic respiration, glucose is completely broken down into carbon dioxide and water. Energy is released in the form of molecules called ATP. Almost all living organisms, including plants and animals, carry out aerobic respiration. This process is represented in an equation form as glucose plus oxygen gives carbon dioxide plus water and 38 molecules of ATP. During anaerobic respiration, glucose is partially broken down into ethanol and carbon dioxide. Hence, only two ATP molecules are formed. Yeasts and some bacteria carry out anaerobic respiration. The equation describing anaerobic respiration is Glucose gives carbon dioxide plus alcohol plus two molecules of ATP. This was all about respiration.